The average age expectation in Denmark is 79 years old. More and more elderly people are exercising. Until now we have seen an increase in the, the percentage of, of elder, those who are over 60 who do, uh, do sport or exercise. So when earlier only few people did sport and exercise and now we have 62% of the Danish uh, population over 60 who do sport or exercise. And we, we can't see that there will be a decline uh, in these numbers. And since the numbers of elderly in general are growing, we will see many more people who will start doing sport and exercise in the clubs or in other, um, yeah, in, in commercial businesses or in other places. We see that uh, health has become very important in society uh, and we know that in, from a health perspective that if you stay active you can live longer and you can uh, keep your motor skills uh, longer into you. When the older you get you will still be able to do a lot of things like get out of the chair, go for a walk. Uh, so that's why it's important to be active from a, from a health perspective. We see that whereas earlier many of the activities for this group were made so you, everybody met up, did some gymnastics at the beginning, they went out to do different disciplines and they took, uh, met up socially afterwards. Today there are more people because they don't consider themselves old and they consider them themselves very active. They want to stay in the type of activity they have been doing previously in their life. Among the elderly, the most popular sports are what we call recreational sports or exercise related types of sports. This means that activities such as walking and hiking is big and they like to do strength training. The, the fitness uh, types of sports have become uh, bigger in this group and they like to do swimming so and gymnastics especially is a big uh, activity for this group and the older you get the more people do gymnastics for example. So let's all follow the example of the Danish elderly people and get active and healthy.